everyone, welcome to another STEAM Saturday. I am Miss Katie and I work at the Hall County Library System at the Gainesville Branch and Youth Services Department. And, and right now, Isla is playing with balloons. We have a super fun STEAM Saturday uh, challenge for you today. We are going to do some fun stuff with balloons. Um, and also, if you hear construction noises in the background, I'm sorry. Our challenge today is to try to get a balloon to fly in a straight line when we let it go. This one's tied off so I can talk a little bit about the properties of a balloon. <laughs> okay, and these are just filled up with regular air, not helium or anything. If it was helium, they would float, but these don't. They fall because they're filled up with regular air. Balloons are made out of latex or another kind of rubber and they are round because the tension of the air inside, the pressure is pushing the balloon out and it's even pressure all the way around. That's what makes a balloon round. And when you have a balloon, yeah, when you have a balloon that's not tied off like this and you let it go, all the air wants to escape from the little, the opening. But because this isn't rigid, it flaps and flies all over the place. And that's what makes a balloon fly in a crazy pattern. So Isla, come here. Come here. Okay. So I want you to pinch this and then we're gonna count down three, two, one, and let it go. Three, three two, two, one. one. So we're going to use this blue balloon and we're going to use some flower tape and we have some wings and a fin already cut out, okay? So, let's try this. Here, a good long piece.
Okay, so now we're ready to get this balloon to fly. Do you want to hold it and let go of it? Okay, pinch it here and give a countdown. Three, two, one, go! Woo! Woo! That worked! That worked! That was awesome! Yeah. So we got our balloon to fly in a straight line. And there are lots of ways that you could expand on this activity. You could do two runs and race balloons. You could see what happens if you don't have the string pulled taunt. You could try to get it to go uphill. You could tie one end really high, one end really low, and see if you can get your balloon to fly uphill. Um, you can continue making fins and uh, feathers and all sorts of stuff to see if you can get your balloon to fly like a bird. This is a real fun activity. I would recommend not doing it on like you don't want it to be a very windy day. Um, it would be fun to do inside on a rainy or a super hot day if you had a long hallway or a garage or something. Uh, I think there are a lot of ways you could expand this activity. And also blow a balloon up, like putting a straw. Yes, you can practice different ways of blowing your balloons up. So make sure to uh, follow the Hall County Library Facebook page for lots of really fun activities. Okay. Um, check our website to see what we've got going on. We've got tons of fun summer reading stuff. You can put books online to pick up for curbside pickup um, and have a lot of fun. So we hope you have a great week and we'll see you next time. Right? <laughs>